Hi, welcome to the recording of the live breakfast show. And this is the recording which I supposed to do uh, earlier, but we have some hiccups. So let's get on with the live breakfast show. So I'd like to welcome you uh, with the ideas that is presented by Smart Roby. Now, in today's sharing, we're going to be talking about why the KLCI is still in Green Pentagon. And actually, we test back the old pig in here. Now, the KLCI remained to be in the Green Pentagon and the up signal. And one of the reasons why is because KLCI remain resilient despite the outflow, which we have seen since it turned the Green Pentagon on the 11th of October. Now, we'll also be taking a look at some stage two shares and our usual Robbie FA collection, which is actually the stock fundamental shares. And of course, the beginners, we really highly recommend you to use the stock FA list. As always, the market is undergoing market volatility in here. So make sure, especially beginners, uh, you want to be collecting some of those uh, mm -hmm. FA stocks. Now, of course, many of you know the Smart Robbie is powered by Pentagon Guider in here. Uh, also, one of the creators of the uh, Pentagon Guide is myself in here, Martin Wong, and one of the methods that we use is volume spread analysis, follow the smart money. Now, of course, with the recent, uh, the KLCI winner and champions, I think it's also good that I want to highlight in form of the past winners, and in this case is Salute, right? Now, it's very important if you can see from this chart in here, uh, what has happened before the market started to move up is the low volume accumulation that we see on the left-hand side here. And this is usual as evident when we begin to see the green pentagon, the market goes up. But what you want to pay notice is the climatic action where we see the extreme high volume in here. And of course, usually when you get to four or five bars of high climatic action with widespread bar, usually that's where the smart Nomi will be distributing. And no surprises that you have one big sell-off in here and completely reverse the market. So especially for those of you who are beginner, learn this as part of your lessons, not to get into one of those high-flying, really uptrend with big spread bar, which usually lure many of the beginners, uh, uh, trader and investor. Now, of course, our VSA 360 is one of the uh, special flagship product of our trade VSA. And of course, those who are members are regularly for new, would you use the insider buy and sell guide that we have in here, not to forget. Now also, let's take a look at the uh, market that we've seen so far in the KLCI. And you can see on the background, we really have strength, right? You can see we have the green pentagon that appeared on the 11th of October. There was a retest back to the 1437 in here. But remember the market, despite we have two weeks or even eight to nine consecutive bars of downtrend, the market didn't go lower. Instead, it actually kept on above the 1435 level and then finally breaks out. And more importantly, the last two bars has turned inflow, which means the market will start to pick up from here onwards. And also take note, where we have the meeting of the railway cross. Remember this railway track were going down towards the October month. We have the spring, which is the sign of strength here. And then now we have the crossing up, which means we are likely to move in the uptrend. And of course, no surprises, which I have informed many of our members of the November month seasonality, which usually in October month, we will have the market bottoming and then the November December, which is we all know is known as the Christmas rally. So make sure you follow me this Wednesday at 9.30. All right, this coming Wednesday, we'll talk about how high can the KLCI go and whether we will surpass the old peak that we have seen in here. So right now, as this market is going up, the 1460, 1465 level, it's likely we will see sign or weakness or some sort of uh, distribution that we have. So you want to make sure that we don't have this and also the uptrust. Okay, let's go on to the next one. And these are the representation that I did last week, whether the market is likely to go up or go down. And of course, finding the market breakup. So we have this above the 1450. Now on the more uh, lagging indicator, which is the cousin of the KLCI is the FKLI futures, which I've shown every Monday in here. You can see it broke through the 1445 and more important, it stay above the 200 day moving average, which is this 
red line in here and has just turned green Pentagon on Thursday. Again, railway track has also crossed up. You can see this two moving average, the 20 and the 40 in here. And right now, as it goes higher, you have the 1460, 1465 level there. Uh, we want to be paying attention to distribution, which is a sign of weakness. Look out for uptrust bar, all right? Here you go. And of course, right now we turn our attention to stage two shares. Now in stage two share of the smart Roby, you will notice these are your so-called uh, um, uh, stocks that are really trending up here. So you can see this market is moving up. And uh, last week, some of the stocks we talked about, uh, BJ Corp, YTL Power and Westport, they have gone up, but they have started to pull back too, but only on Thursday and Friday. So keep an eye on all these stocks. I think the, uh, the trend is still continuing in, in upwards. And of course, not to forget this week, on this Monday here, uh, the 6th of November, some of the stocks will still continue the current trend, uh, AWC and pay attention to the Hong Leong Hub, Leong Hub, which is a poultry business in here. Gatronics also uh, tending higher and Matrix, Adana and AWC. So this is the one, it is still in the stage two shares. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our daily newsletter. This is the QR code that you see on the left-hand side. If you want to see all kinds of news that usually read by me and sort of giving you an idea uh, where is the status of the pending on gold. Now, let's turn our attention now to Spot Roby, the FA collection here. And FA collection is one of the menu that you see. And of course, last week, 30th of October, we were talking about Hong Leong industry. All right, you can see from Hong Leong industry, uh, we were around just below $9 and Lo and behold, within a week, broken through the 921. Uh, uh, as the time of uh, in the morning when the slide was done was 940 uh, here, and it's up 2.8%, uh, uh, up 2.8%, which is a very nicely done level here. And of course, this week, let's look at the 6th of November, and we have the Roby FA stocks, and we'll be looking into two stocks which is uh, CCK and also Cycom. All right, CCK and Cycom are two FA stocks and how well they perform. Let's take a look at them now, right now. Now, CCK, again, it's a poultry stock. So you can see building up a nice space just below 80 cents and ready to move higher. They have a green pentagon here. And, uh, you know, we, we really want to pay attention how high in this go. The old resistance is about 84 cents. So let's see where it's likely to end within today here. All right. And my last checkup at the time of this recording, market did perform much, much higher in here and actually up almost 1%, already retesting back the old high. And of course, Cycom, which I talked about uh, at the time of this time was making in here, was just below 1,112. And I think this market would have gone higher, but right? of course, next week, we'll come back and take a look at this. Now, definitely one of the unique proposition of Pentagon Guider is the uh, availability on the smart robby. You can see with green Pentagon, you get up signal. And with Pentagon, red Pentagon, you have the red signal. It's really simplified all the technical analysis, especially for beginners, but find it a bit overwhelming. And this definitely will give you an edge. Together with the watch list that we have in smart robby apps uh, on a daily basis, you can really set this to your advantage. Just for example, if you are looking at some particular technology stocks that you have in mind, you can always put into your watches. Not only that, you can also create another watches or another exchange. In this case, it can be the US market where some of the big tech stocks really making a move, as I said before, in the month of November, this will be the more bullish months, which will put you in a nice favorable. Now take a look at this one in here. Whenever you see the blue cell, that is likely the market was going to go higher right and then eventually the alert will come up you probably get this and you can also add the stocks in here so for those stocks who have the uh, green pentagon that's where you get the alert and some of the stocks that you have the uh, red pentagon you also get the alert all these are available through the uh, tab menu you see in the bottom check out that investment tab in here highlighted in blue which means you have have Pentagon alert. Usually it's going to be up or down signal in here, right? And also uh, keep in mind, it will be notified in your mobile handphones on your usual notification. Now, of course, uh, do join us 
uh, every Monday for the Spark Roby, the announcement that I've said earlier on, uh, beginning the 8th of November, we will resort back to the old format that we have. We have on Friday the breakfast show with VSA 360, and on Monday we alternate between the uh, Roby Busa, which is the Malaysian market, and also Roby for the US market on the, uh, the even week. So on the second and the fourth uh, Monday of the month, we will do the uh, Spark Roby US, and on the first third and the fifth Monday of the month, we'll do the Smart Lobby for Busa. So we, we get to cover everything for our members not to miss on this. Right, uh, join me this coming Wednesday, 9.30, where I'll be touching on, on this special topic on live at uh, Facebook. Is the stock market Busa KLCI ready to solve beyond its previous peak? And of course, we have already seen tonight at the time of this recording, it has broken uh, the 1465. Interesting amount to see where it's going. And of course, those of you who continue to support us, uh, especially our uh, Trade VSA members, uh, our uh, premium uh, premium membership in here, we thank you for your support. And those of you who are our regular or from the public, you might want to explore and check out our Trade VSA orientation onboarding which we will guide you through our uh, tools, just like many of our so-called uh, uh, students, which done pretty well. We can see from the result that we have over the last six months uh, with a very reasonable, even very improved group, uh, win rates uh, that you've seen here. Check it out yourself in the Trade VSA uh, website, as well as on our live Facebook. So as a summary, as I said before, the KLCI has broken the higher peak and uh, really, really, going to test the 1470 and with the incoming of uh, foreign funds inflow that will certainly give a lot of room for it to go uh, of course as the market goes higher you want to watch out for the sign of weakness especially the ut but those of you who are beginner might want to stick to the roby fa stocks to collect some dividend especially many of them are don't forget to sign up for our newsletter and smash that subscribe button to trade vsa and of course those of you who are ready, just go over to our tradebsa.com pricing in here. You can sign up for our Trade VSA premium membership in here that we have been reviewed and uh, recommended highly by our current existing members for some of the uh, good features and good visual uh, trading plan that we have. So we really thank you for our existing members in here. And of course, those of you who have a couple of stocks for me to review, do post it in our uh, Facebook Smart Robbie in here and we are happy to look into that. And finally, last but not least, is our Telegram chat group, where this is the one that we are able to uh, make good use of our, our educational program that we're able to reach you on time. So that's all we have for this evening. Okay. And a recording in here. So I'll see you on Wednesday.